Oh, poor engineers. They're getting a book so much. I don't think I'm that like because some of the um. I can do a, 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 a race mass... like outside. They can do a mass res thing as well. It only works with people within five yards of it. It's called a failure detection pylon. I remember them talk about that in one of the interviews. They were like, it's just like an item that if you knew you were going to wipe, everyone just stacks up on it and dies. Gun shoes, attach guns to your feet, to your feet propelling you forward. <laughs> it's somewhat called Reeves battery, and then you can put modules on it. Yeah, that, I think that's a little mech that you can summon. Yeah, snack distribution mode. <laughs> <laughs> or be, yeah, I think it's basically like a, a whatever it's called, Jeeves sort of thing. Because it can do repair mode, combat mode. What's this meat to pet transmission or meat to pants transmission? <laughs> Transmute broken hours meat in the pants. What the fuck? Set out, you can make cloth, chests, dollar and citizens, it says. You can put it down in. Invade some parties and people can try out clothes or something. <laughs> There's a molten core one as well. Try out clothes. Well, Tor seems to like it. There's a molten core one. I if I get like a legendary item the first, anyway, I can kill on the broken isle. <laughs> There's, gonna be... There's gonna be some lucky fuck who gets the first legendary from like the first enemy they kill on the broken isle. Yeah, it's probably gonna be Tor. Yeah, Geocrafters can make a toy as well. It's called uh, Dual Craft. Um, playing a dual matching game. It's basically like playing Bejeweled in WoW. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> you, know what's gonna cool. you know what's going to happen now, though, don't you? You'll be sat in a raid. Sat in a raid and frantically talking away, and you'll be like playing Bejeweled. 